How was the overnight retreat? A couple of hours of chakra balancing and hot stone massage does wonders for a man. I've been buffed, brushed and pampered within an inch of my life. <laughs> Rachel talk you into it. Yeah, and I'm very glad she did. You do seem to have a certain aura of relaxed invincibility. <laughs> Let's just see how long this lasts. Excuse me. Alistair, hi. Karen, good to see you again. You all know Chris Warner, of course. Hi. And this is Deborah. Nice to meet you. Hi. So please, uh, take a seat. Oh, you're cutting it fine. Sorry, traffic. I hope there's enough. There's heaps. What's this? What does it look like? You've seen sushi before, haven't you? I don't understand. You know what they're talking about in there, don't you? Well, I should do. I typed the agenda 20 times. This new healthy menu thing is really big for the hospital. I thought sushi would be more appropriate. What's wrong? What do you think I ordered anyway? Cream buns and chocolate eclairs? Something like that? Oh, give me some credit, Maya. There is such a thing as healthy baking, you know. Does it matter we've got all this? Yes, it matters. It matters if you're pregnant and you can't eat sushi. It matters if you're allergic to seafood, which one of them is? What am I supposed to do now? Hello, uh, this is Brooke Freeman speaking. I was wondering if I could make an appointment with Dr. Rupa later today. Okay, when's the earliest she can see me? I see, and how long will she be away? I'll see how I'm feeling tomorrow. Uh, if I'm still not right, I'll call back and make an appointment with the locum. Thank you. You know, a few hours ago, I never thought that this would happen. I'm so glad you came to see me. <laughs> Only to tell you why we shouldn't be together. <laughs> You've been through so much grief, Sophie. Hey, I was trying to do the right thing. Well, lucky for you, I know what the right thing is. <laughs> yeah, lucky me. Hey, how was the movie? Great. It was okay. Ah, uh, she didn't get to see what she wanted. No, he didn't drag you to that karate movie, did he? Uh, I'm the one who got dragged into every second shot between here and the movie theatre. Mm, looks like it. Were you making up for lost time? Uh, show Sarah what you bought. Waiter. Oh, I should start cooking anyway. Are you hungry? Starving. I'm tired. Mm, takes it out of you spending money, doesn't it? Why don't you go and lie down for a bit? I'll call you when dinner's ready. How was she? Quiet. I think she said ten words the whole time. Oh, well, that's an advance on yesterday. Oh, she perked up a bit when I got my credit card out there. <laughs> that's normal enough. I just wish I had more time to spend with her. I was getting somewhere today. I know I was. It's a shame you have to work tomorrow. Yeah. Well, I don't. Why don't I do something with her? You don't have to do that. She's your daughter. I'd like to get to know her better. Come on down, quick pour her a glass of wine. Hi, how'd you get on with the bakery? Ah, oh, could have been worse, I suppose. I, I called an urgent courier, it was all on Callum's desk in 20 minutes. Phew. Had major expense, I might add. I'm happy to pay for it, send me the bill. Don't worry, I will. I'm really sorry, I was only trying to help. It's the way you went about it. Full marks for initiative, but if you'd bothered to talk to me first, you could have saved us both a lot of stress. Yeah, I know. But I have worked in that place for years, but I still can't be trusted to get anything right, can I? It's not about the job. It's... It's about what you've been through, Mum. You think I've been driven mad by grief? Is that, is that what you're saying? No. Because that's what it sounds like. Yeah. Thanks. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. Look, you've both had grief in your life. You know what it's like. There are two things that'll help you get through it. Time. Three things. Family. And work. Not too much of any of them. That's why I was trying to help. And that's why I've decided to move back home. Why? Why be miserable by yourself? When I can be miserable here with you? 
thank you for everything that you have done, both of you. Now, Friday night, dinner at my place, put that in your diaries. And no, I don't need any help with the catering thing. <laughs> <laughs> Are you okay? Mm-hmm. Um, can you pass me my bag, please? <sighs> Thank you. Have you seen your GP yet? Right, come with me. No, 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 I'll go. Oh. You're not going anywhere till you've seen a doctor. Now. 